If your PC gets crashed or corrupted, then you need to do a clean install of Windows on it using a bootable USB. Creating a bootable USB flash drive using a PC is easy. But what if you do not have a second computer to create a bootable USB? In such situations, creating a bootable USB drive using an Android phone can be a good option. So in this video, let's see how to create a Windows bootable USB on an Android phone without using a PC. First of all, open your browser and download a Windows ISO file from the Microsoft's official website. I am gonna download Windows 11. Go to the section Download Windows 11 Disk Image ISO for x64 devices. Select Windows 11 and click Download Now. Choose your language and click Confirm. Then click on 64-bit download. Now the download should start. We'll use a third-party app that will create a bootable USB drive on Android. In this case, Rufus is the best app for this kind of operation. So, go to the Play Store, search for Rufus and download it. Please note that this is not the official app from Rufus that we use it on PC. However, this app can do the job free of cost. After installing the app, connect your USB flash drive to your Android phone using an OTG adapter. Make sure that the OTG is connected properly. On some Android phones, you might need to enable the OTG connection from the settings app. Now comes the major part of making the USB bootable. So open the Rufus app. Allow Rufus to access the USB drive. To create a bootable USB, first you have to earn 2 coins by watching ads. Once you have collected 2 coins, you can proceed to use this app. Select the MBR or GPT option depending on your PC. MBR is compatible with older computers. If you have a newer computer with UEFI firmware, you should select GPT. Then, click on Pick ISO button and select the Windows ISO file that you downloaded. Now, click the Start button. The bootable USB creation has started. Wait for 15 to 20 minutes and your bootable USB will be ready. Once the process is completed, it will show a message that the burning ISO file is done successfully. Finally, you can remove the USB drive from your phone and connect it to your PC where you want to install Windows. Now you can boot your PC from the USB drive and install Windows operating system on it without any problems. Guys, as you have seen, creating a Windows bootable USB on your Android phone is not that hard. And actually, it can be very useful when you don't have any other machines or tools available. You can also use this method for Linux, Ubuntu, Android x86 or any other ISO files. Have you ever tried to create a bootable USB this way? Share your experience with us in the comment section below.